Hey everybody, this is uh, Carl coming to you. Just wanted to take a moment out and come to you all and talk about something that's really been on my mind today. In the past couple of days, maybe even the past week or two, really have been experiencing a lot of attack mentally um, by the enemy through temptation and, and struggles. But the thoughts most of all, the thoughts of loneliness, the thoughts of quitting, of wanting to give up, a feeling like I just can't take it anymore being so overwhelmed with everything feeling like feeling like I just can't catch up with life feeling like I can't catch up with school can't catch up with ministry just can't catch up with the day-to-day -day things and even listening to the lies of the enemy uh, of you know you're not good enough you know uh, maybe you should just quit give up go home all of those things have been going on feeling like a hypocrite my own self feeling like I can't pray can't fast can't get in the word can't get to that place with God and I just wanted to come to encourage my brothers and my sisters who have been going through the same things to say to you that you're in a good place you're at the place where you're right on the verge of our we're, we together collectively are right on the verge of a breakthrough everything that God has promised us is yea and amen his word is true through and through the word of God is true everything that the enemy has told you is a lie everything that has been going on in your mind or in your world that is opposite of the word of God is a lie and so I tell you today be encouraged and let's pray Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, God, I lift up every person that watches this video. God, I pray for the people of God. Lord, I pray for our minds, oh God. I plead the blood of Jesus. I plead the blood of Jesus over our minds, oh God. And I decree and declare, Father, that we are strong and mighty in you. Father, I decree and declare that every lie of the enemy be turned around and returned into his own bosom. In the name of Jesus, Father, I decree, God, that the gates of hell shall not prevail against us. God, but we shall continually to press forward into enemy hell territory. In the name of Jesus, God, I decree and declare that our minds are sober. We are sober-minded, settled in the word of God as to what you said about us. Father, we know that your word is true. You're not a man that you should lie. So God, even now, we take authority over our minds and we gird up the loins of our minds with the word of God. And Father, we decree and declare that we are strong and mighty in you. Father, we thank you, God, that even though the weapon may be formed, it shall not prosper against us. Satan, the Lord God, rebuke you now. I rebuke you out of the mind of the believer. I rebuke your words and I bind them. And I declare decree and declare, God, that angels are picking up the seed of the word of the Lord that we have planted in our atmospheres. And Father, that they are battling the enemy even now. And Father, that we have the victory. Father, because in you, God, we live and we move and we have our being. Father, this battle is not ours. It is the Lord's. And so, God, we put it in your hands. And Father, we declare as the psalmist did in Psalm 37, 5, that we cast our way before the Lord. Trust also in him and he shall bring it to pass we decree and declare this day that it is so in jesus name amen you all be encouraged and know that the best is yet to come god bless you